Terrell Suggs mic'd up today, y'all. Hey, Reed. Sizzle got on the mic. Sizzle! Hey, Reed. Hey, bring that boom mic down. See if you can hear Airways' thoughts. Bring it down close. I he want do it. to. He do it all the time. That mic guy, said. He does a great job. I was just wondering if I didn't have a competitive edge. If I didn't want to be great. If I was content. You tired today? Content with me, you me. Yeah. So that's going to stop you from practicing good, huh? No. You doing it. There we go. <laughs> Let's warm up. Let's go. Ooh, you hit him. You, you do this every day. You know, you're in my way. You're in my way. This, that, that would be the smartest thing to do to just take the whole. <laughs> Thank you. I'm your friend every day, ain't I? Yeah. On some days when I ain't mess up. When I'm in my right gap. Sizzle! It's simple. <laughs> Play football, man. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> it happened in practice and it happened in the game. It's time to grow up, man. Be held accountable. <laughs> oh, so what you be doing? Memorizing it? Okay. You gotta take the good with the bad. I'm gonna take your turn zone. I'm gonna back zone you. I'm gonna stretch you just a little bit and I'm gonna drive you. Hit your spots, okay? Turn zone, back zone, and then I'm gonna break you right out. Here we go. Hut! This cheeseburger. Four six hamburger, ready? Chips! We bring in chips! Hey, thank you, thank you. And there's the famous Ravens Wired Adelia's the Thomas, Thomas, the coordinator, ladies and gentlemen. The coordinator of Ravens Wired. This man <laughs> know everything there is to know about the football business. He did everything from play defense to tackle. To play in strong safety. In barbecue and real. <laughs> oh, y'all. He got the recipe. I don't even eat barbecue until I go to AD house. I'm saying. He got, he got the recipe. recipe. He got the ribs. Ribs so good, know. you don't need you sauce. know what his special sauce is. If you need sauce, he apologize. apologize. Don't nobody know this, but Adelia's Thomas' secret sauce is pork and bean juice. <laughs> Good job, it's the same thing. Remember, I showed you that on paper this morning? Yeah. About when you put the body. It. Right. So when you body, you're going to body more high. Okay. You're going to body more high than low. So see, if you stay low, you just waste some ground. Okay. See, if you body high, he never sees you and throws you that ball. Okay. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. On the road is hard, but it's capable. You know what? We got to win a turnover margin, baby. Let's do it. We had no turnover all year. We need something from you, big boy. Get all right. Job. Five, 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 we need one from you. All right. Get well. well. To the football. Get well. To the football. Get well. To the football. Right. And hit anything moving. And hit anything moving. And hit anything moving. And hit anything moving. <laughs> See, that's actually curriculum. I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that. Somebody can grab you after the whistle going. That's that's uncalled for, especially if you had them beat. They just trying to look good for the film. So I had to let him know it was Big Daddy out there. 
Smart now. We need you all day long today. Right. You follow me? Be smart. You'll get his later. That came true right there. He told me to be smart. That's like foreshadowing. That's why coach is a good coach. You put your hands all up in my face, dog, and I was trying to get I him out of the face, man. You was pulling me down with you. I'm not a dirty player. Snap, you pushed me up in the face, man. That's oh, all I'm I was sorry. trying you to get You know, I don't play high. You watch right. film, I don't play up in there. Right. I'm good to the sport, man. I thought you were doing purpose in the face, man. You kept it. I'm like, I know, son. All right, man. You a good player, man. I ain't dirty. You ain't dirty. You I, I just play you. hard. That's I feel you. My bag on that one there. That's all we do. All right. I'm pretty cool with everybody in the league. You know, I'm just. I'm just a happy guy, you know, I'm a kid in a candy store when I'm playing, so, sometimes. Oh, that hurt right there. Good luck, Joey. See, look, that play over. That play is over. Look at everybody. That play is over. All hits have got a price, boy. That hit hurt. I ain't gonna lie to you. It, it hurt. Like, I felt tingling through my body. I don't know it's because I made the good hit or I thought I had a sack. I don't really know, but it, it does hurt. And uh, that's why I raised the greatest, because he does it over and over and over again. And he's not just hitting quarterbacks. He's hitting fullbacks, running backs, linemen, tight end. Ray hit everybody. He even hits us sometimes. No, he hands off to Jones. And he is in for the touchdown. We got to play football, get off the damn field on third down. It's that simple. It's that simple. That's Raven defense. Get them in a long third and long and let us pass rushers go get them. That's, that's Raven D. And we, we didn't do a good job of that early at all. Man, listen. These guys ain't done nothing on us. Not do y'all understand? They living off a damn wing of a prayer. They living off a damn wing of a prayer, man. I'm telling you, everything that they did, we done gave it to them. Everything. How many times we got to do that before we wake up? Back to throw is Harrington on first down. Has time and it's batted down at the line of scrimmage. That's the one he was about to throw me anyway. Yeah, that was a up pick. You know yeah. it, Joey. That was a pick. <laughs> oh, man. A slow motion. <laughs> my brother, man. That's like my big brother right there, Ray and AD. They all, they always been taking care of me since I got here, both of them. They kind of took me under their wing, and I don't think besides, you know, my mom, you know, and my dad, I don't think I have two bigger fans, you know, than Ray and AD. And I feel the same about them. So when I do something good, they're the first to come over and congratulate me. But I was a little slow, though. I got to work on my speed this all season, man. I'm always getting tackled by the quarterback. You watch there, that was just behind Williams. And Suggs just steps in and takes it. When they shifted into the empty, I seen that the, the running back went out and that they had me on Roy Williams. And, you know, over the years, I picked up from Adelius and, and Ray that that's what, that's what the offensive coordinator wants. They want a speedy receiver on a linebacker so they can get the mismatch. And I wasn't gonna go out as far, but if y'all can listen or you can hear it, you tell you, uh, Ray Lewis, say, move out a little bit more, says him. And like when he said that, he must have saw something that I didn't see. So I slide it over, and I was, and then it all just started coming to me. I just backpedal, and then as soon as I saw he went out, I just had earlier in the game they did that, but the ball got blocked. So I think I knew they were gonna kind of come back to it. Great job. Make sure we're focusing on the football, okay, guys. You gotta beat one. Slow down. Hey. Yeah, you gotta run that How come I couldn't get a block? You gotta <laughs> <cut> it, <man>. <laughs> <laughs> AD always tell me to pitch it. Every time, like if I get one in practice, he'd be like, just pitch it, just pitch it. Cause uh, they always make fun of my speed. But I think, you know, my speed to the quarterback is pretty good. But I guess that open field sprinted speed, I, I still gotta work on. Good pick, dog. Do you like that? You know, I had to. What's that call? <laughs> yeah. Can't let the quarterback get me. Oh, hold up. I should have trucked it, you know, went back to my Hamilton high day. I was running back, boy. I was, uh, I had it all. That's when I was somewhat fast, and I was about 235, all muscle ripped, and I was just a good back. I was shifty, moving, cutting, running people over. Never in high school would a quarterback had tackled me, but that's what happens when you 
go from running back to defensive end. Just know that at most quarterbacks, regardless of me, will probably just try and kick your legs out. So you should practice the hurdle. The hurdle? Yeah, because you know he's going at your legs. My boy Kyle, we came in together, so man, him, you know, you know, we, we always going to be like that. Like Ray and J.O., you know, they came in together. So me and Kyle got that kind of relationship. You know, we're going to come in together. We're going to be here for a long time. So it's going to be it's going to be pretty fun. You know, I had to add that to my resume. You know, everybody know I can pass rush. Oh, yeah. I want to show them I can cover. I was out there on Roy Williams. Oh, yeah. Locked him down. I'm right here with him. <laughs> Locked him up like like Prime or A. Reed or, you know, Matt. I had, I had to get, you know, I got the best coverage, you know, corners and safeties. You know, I got the greatest to play the game, and Max the greatest in the game right now. And, you know, A. Reed is A. Reed. So, I had to, you know, I got, I got tools that I, that I take from them what I'm covering. You was 10 yards at the quarterback when you... He had, yeah. he had the pursuit angle, CB. I got you. Everybody take some deep breaths. They know us. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes I forget with Mike. I actually took the deep breath. But, you know, everything, you know, 5-2 say, I listen to because he where I'm trying to get. You see what I'm saying? He got him a Super Bowl ring. Got him two defensive MVPs. So, he definitely, I, I'm definitely going to listen to what he got to say. Hey. Hey, you're in coverage. And what we're going to do, I told AD, look, if they trade on us, Warren Wolf or Cougar, go ahead, hey. stay put. Let's get you coming on a couple of things. Yeah. We're getting on to that. Little that bit now, he always coaching. That's one thing. That's one thing about Fitzgerald. He's very passionate about what he's doing. And if you got a coach that it's as passionate as you are about your job, and he just as passionate about his. You know, you two can work together. Y'all gonna go places together. So, Fitzgerald coming, I think that was a big part of me transforming, from me making the transformation from a defensive end to a linebacker. So now I can do both, and it only helped me as a player. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. That was a good one. Oh. You keep hitting me on my head, it's gonna be a problem. I'm gonna wash them hands. What are you feeling right now? Just it's like just, it's huh? Yeah. Yeah. That happened right when Ray hit dude, when he hit Kevin Jones. Like I came down and I tried to hit him and hurt my back right then and there. Bill T got me right, but it was still hurting and I had just had to go. Wow, playing too passionate, man. I really want to win. I really want to win. Bad enough, that was a bad call. And this is a good visual of what happens when uh, you lose your composure and you ain't playing smart. You ain't thinking smart. You have been ejected. Listen, listen. You have been ejected. Why? Because you can't football since we need you, baby. My dad didn't like it too much at all. Dad called me. He was like, uh-uh. You can't be doing that. He says, always keep your composure, baby. It was a bad call. We know we've been getting bad calls all day. Don't lose your composure out there, man. We need you. You know how valuable you are to us, man? Before Sunday, I didn't really know the value that I had on this team because as you look on our defense, our defense is stacked full of players. I mean, we have players everywhere on defense, whether it's Ed Reed, Chris McAllister, Adelius Thomas, Anthony Weaver, or Ray Lewis. Deion Sanders, you know. I just thought, you know, me being 23, I'm just a part of my, they play my part as a pass rusher, you know. But uh, when I got through out and everybody came to me, I kind of, I kind of, as I was walking back, I kind of knew, like, did I just hurt us? I was kind of questioning myself. I, matter of fact, I knew that I just delivered a blow to my team. And uh, I can't do that. Like, my coach told me early in the game, just play smart. And like I said, I let a call, I let a referee, you know, make a call that get the best of me. I really think I hurt my team from me losing my composure. So I'm definitely going to have to pay them back <laughs> for this one. I definitely don't.